So inside the package, <clears throat> so they also sent me a. I think this is a spare um, bracelet for the watch and a screen protector. And of course the cutout. So let's start to unbox. So here's the thing. Um, what's what is the box? So the box is made out of I think this is an acetate in front of the, uh, in the front part of the box. Then the sides. Then you have the Mi logo there. The sides and the basic information about the product. So. It says here the Mi Bantry, what kind of model, battery type, package contents, IP rating, and it is manufactured for Xiaomi Communications Co Company, manufactured by Anhui Wami Information Technology. So it's manufactured in China, manufactured for Xiaomi. Then uh, the battery type is the normal. Uh, polymer battery and the package includes fitness tracker, the wristband, charging cable, user manual, and of course the color is black. So here, so let's open it. Are we just doing the unboxing or do we want to have a first impression thing, kind of thing okay so you can you you're not able to remove this um part so it's a flip to open and you have the product there and you have this paper here so you can lift up the product so here like i saw that it turned on already okay so there is a sticker there but you can see that it's already starting. So this is the wristband. So it's in black. I already he also sent me a blue one. So let's open it and put it side by side. The blue and the black. The blue. Masyadong lumihim. Okay. Ah, okay. Okay. Akala ko wala siyang yung lock. Okay. So that's how you do it. I guess ganito lang kaliit yung product. Ito yung styrofoam. Sana pati yung blue meron din ganito para hindi siya na-deform. Pero hindi naman siya na-deform. So, okay lang. So, we'll try this on later. Then, also in the box. Oops. The user manual. Look cute. So, it's in Chinese. Another language. Let's look for the English. Okay. Nasa unahan yung English language. So, yun. And of course, the charger. So I need to charge. Charger cable. Ang pangit lang wala siyang plug, but it's okay. Pero yun yung charger cable. So kailangan mo ng additional plug for it. Kailangan mo siya yung charge sa laptop mo and stuff. So, let's move on to the main device. Device, the main device. Okay. So, push ko daw siya from. Ayun. <laughs> Scary. Taka to. <laughs> May slit naman siya daw. And I think it's secured. So, it is this small. Yeah, it's just this small. So, let me peel off. I don't know. Ano ba yan? 
about the cute naman so let's try to set it up so it says pair device first so i will pair the device first and be right back we're back so i have set up to me bag already Let's see. Why is it not working? Anyway, so here is the so here is the interface of the Mi Pad 3. And this is the default. Then you can hmm, swipe up to see your steps, your heart rate. So today the weather. If you're planning to exercise you have to to um long press this one then it also has the notifications part so you can see your notifications there depends on uh, what you have set up in the application on your phone so the home button will it but then it should swipe um, to left or right to see so it to your own as the steps this distance burn calories battery remaining see i have to charge the device already since i will go <laughs> i just got this so i got it at 25 percent battery so why not so you but for the sake of first impression review and whatnot let's see heart rate so they use sensor now so let's try to press it. Then, yeah, the green new sensor. So sabi dapat one inch above the wrist, and dapat hindi siya masadong um masikip and hindi din siya masadong malawak. Kasi it will affect the heart rate sensor. So try lang natin. This will be inaccurate already since hindi siya nakal detect since nag start. See, ayon yung detect. So yeah, let's start. Let's try. Sorry, so fingers. Bawat ang um, cutex. So far na. <laughs> so how have you been, guys? Wala na ba ulan sa inyo? Dito rainy na. Rainy kapag gabi. Tapos ma maaraw kapag ano? Kapag umaga. Super araw. So yun. Then, may record siya dun sa application. So, I, for me, I think yung price nito is nasa 1,900 or 2,500. Depende kung saan mo binibili. Um, this was just sent to me for free. But, all the things that I have said is based on my observation. Halata naman. I have not really read about the product. Itself. So, gusto ko lahat um, from me. So, everything is solely from me. So, I like the design kasi it's very sleek. Pwede pwede siya for girls. Kasi meron yung mga smartwatches and bands, diba, na sobrang bulky. What I don't like about it is... Noon ako, diba? What I don't like about it is yung charger na because you still have to remove it the the mismo device from the band and you have to plug it in then plug it in again and stuff unlike dun sa Samsung which is medyo siguro times 10 yung price maybe ng Samsung na pinapatong yun lang dun sa husband ko ganun yun pinapatong lang yun tapos wireless charging siya so, hindi na niya kailangan i-disassemble yung watch itself. So, yun lang. Ito lang yung kinakatakot ko dahil nga external lahat. You have to remove it. You have to remove this. So, sana hindi ko mawala yung mga bagay-bagay. Ayun lang. And, it claims that it is water resistant. So, I think I shall try this for a week first before I can do another review. So, ano lang top your review. <laughs> it's already 3.40 guys. So, natry ko siya for one week para 
um, I can update. Kasi yung mga nakikita kong YouTube reviews is sa ibang bansa pa. So, wala pa akong nakita ng Pinoy na nag-review. If meron man, please comment down below or message me na lang. I want to know kung ano rin yung take nila dito sa Mi Band na to. So, yun. Ito, tatry ko yung tatry ko nyan ilagay yung screen protector in a while. Pero, do sa next update, I will be trying it for a week. Then, for a week also, I'll do my usual routine na mag magja-jogging tapos mag-aalaga ng baby. Then, I might go to the gym also. So, let's see kung ano yung kaya niya sa heart rate sensor niya, kung accurate pa and stuff. I will be comparing both the results sa Mi Band 3 tsaka dun sa um, built-in application ng Apple iPhone na health stuff na nagme-measure din ng steps and heart rate and stuff like that. So, ayun. Ito yung Mi Band 3, guys. First impression. It looks good, actually. Pwede pwede siyang pang casual. Pwede rin siyang, dahil pumapasok ako. Care and care naman yung palitan si Tasha ko. Once in a while, so. Ayan. Hope you like it, guys. And, ayun. <clears throat> See you next time. Bye-bye. Medyo nag-ready tayo dito. Forgive me. I just want to update you guys. Doon sa mga nakakita sa akin na naka-blonde yung parang um, inner part ng hair ko. So now, I colored it last night actually with Sparks color. So this is Purple Passion. Super pretty as in super nice. And since hindi naman pantay yung pagkaka-lift ko or brighten ko dun sa hair ko dahil ako lang mag-isang gumawa. Hindi ko na nahinto yung husband ko. Um, ganyan din yung color niya. Since meron dark, meron light, ganyan. Oh, I liked it naman kasi parang hindi lang siya flat purple. So, meron siyang pagka um, maroon-ish. Meron yung bright na bright na purple. Then, sinadya kong hindi mo nalagyan yon Yung dito sa side na to. Kasi, hinantay ko yung husband ko. Gagawin ko siyang, I don't know, any suggestions? Kung pink ba or teal or something? Medyo going for mermaid hair, pero okay lang naman kahit ano. Um, and baka ipa ganda, di ba? So pretty. So pretty. Pumasok ako kanina sa school. So parang sabi niya lang, Uy, ate, kahapon yellow pa lang yung buhok mo. Ganyan, ganyan. So yun. So pretty for me. Para siya, ano, watercolor. Joke. Yan, mas matingkat dito. Di ba? So pretty. I like it. So, Sparks color. Halagyan ko. Um, comments naman guys kung anong color maganda. Yun dun. Pink, tapos sig or maybe teal. Medyo green. Tapos may pagka pink. Hanggang sa maging purple siya. I don't know. Let's see. Kung anong pwedeng itry. So, update lang. And it's really, really pretty. I really, really recommend it. 